guys so today I have a really exciting video for you guys and I am doing a collab with three other girls and we have makeup that's me and then Sara is doing her fall purse essentials Monica is doing fall outfits Rachel is doing her fall faves so if you guys want to check out the rest of our collab videos definitely check out down below I will have all their links and so if you want to figure out how I got this fall makeup look, then just keep on watching. First, I'm taking the shade Naked, and I'm just using that as a transition shade in my crease. Then using the It's Judy Time palette, I'm taking this reddish-brown color and putting that in my crease. Then taking the bronzy shade in that same palette, I'm going to place that on the outer half of my lid up to the crease. Taking the shade Half Baked out of the Urban Decay Naked palette, I'm going to place that on the inner part and up to the It's Judy Time shade. Then taking Creep out of the Urban Decay palette, I'm going to put that in my outer V and make it a little more smoky, and I'm just going to layer that until I get the desired color that I want. Then I'm taking Buck out of the Naked palette and I'm going to place that underneath on my lower lash line just to smoke it out a little. Taking that highlight out of the Ish Judy Time palette and I'm going to place that on my brow bone and inner corner. Then I'm going to take the brush and just blend. I'm using the e.l.f. Lock On Gel Liner in black and then the nude shade on my lower lash line. And I'm just going to apply some black e.l.f. liquid liner and I'm going to wing it out like normal. Then I'm using just mascara, I'm using the Maybelline Colossal. For eyelashes, I'm using Cara's 415 lashes. They're really nice and spaced out and dramatic. And then I'm just going to press them down with a pair of tweezers. Then just going back over that with my black eyeliner and filling in all the blue spots and then just kind of fan them out. And there's the completed eyes. Then for my lips, I'm taking um, Wet n Wild lipstick in Cherry Bomb. And then I'm just taking NYX's lip liner in Current and just outlining and defining that. Um, as you'll see, I did have a little bit of problem trying to get both sides and the corners even, but nothing a q-tip can't fix. And then I'm just going to reapply the lipstick, and that's the completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.